Hey, welcome, Chris here. It's my pleasure to bring you another uh, prepper challenge. Today we're going to we're going to test out some canned pears, which are probably my favorite. Uh, it's funny that I waited this long to to test these ones out, but they've been in uh, they've been in my food storage for years. We'll check on the the best use by date. I think they're at least five years old. Um, yeah, so we'll run them through the basic. A sight test. We'll look at the can to see if there's any bulging. We will uh, open the can, smell the the pears on the inside. We'll test them for their consistency, see how they look, uh, and then finally I'm going to give them a taste. Which um, I'm always ready for some canned pears. Pear is one of my favorite fruits. So uh, yeah, thanks for joining. Let's see how these pears are looking. So these are the pears. Looks like they are. Let's pick the can up. Get a look at it. S and W Premium Pear Habs Natural Style Bartlett Pears in Lightly Sweetened Juice from Concentrate. Concentrate. Okay. Oh, great. It says pull lid tab. Oh, this has a has a puller on top. Nice. Don't have to get the can opener out. All right. Let's check out the best use by date on the bottom here. Okay. It says best use by. 622 of 13 so we're coming up on seven years old so they're not too old but uh now they're they're best used seven years ago i probably bought them a couple of years before that they were in a multi-pack all right well let's take a look at the can it looks like it's in good shape it's just been sitting in in storage crawl space uh yeah i'm, I'm not detecting any it looks like it could be sitting on my my cupboard Right, so look, the can looks good. All right, let's give it the one-handed open. It's always a little tricky, but since it has a the pull tab, I can just pull it. And I'll listen. Oh, I don't hear any rush of wind or bad air. Okay, let's see what these things look like. Well, yep, that looks like a what I expect the inside of a can of pears to look like. All right, let's get this into a bowl. Let's uh, smell it and see what the consistency looks like. All right, here's what the here's what the pears look like in a in a bowl, just fresh out of the can. I've got a spoon in there because I always like to to get a little bit of the syrup. And then with the fork, we're gonna see how the how the flesh of the pear is held up. So if I get one and turn it over. Just give it a scrape. Yeah, they're not disintegrating too terribly much. The I can pick a pair up. It doesn't fall apart. That's good. So yeah, it uh, seems to have held up fairly well. I'm not getting any smells, so I'm not. Uh, yeah, there's no no telltale smells of spoilage or anything like that. All right. Well, these look good. They're uh, the consistency's held up well. Now there's uh, one thing left to do. Let's uh, take her for a taste test. All right, so these pears are looking good. I'm looking at them up close. They don't, yeah, they may be a little smaller than I'm used to seeing, but I don't, I don't know that they would have shrunk in the can so much. Um, they could have just been small pears. Let's see. Yeah. It smells like pears out of a can. Take that first taste. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it uh, just like a pear taste when it comes out of a can. Mm -hmm. Not bad. Get a little bit of the syrup in there. Mm hmm. Yeah, delicious. Well. I'll enjoy these off camera. So, uh, yeah, this these these pass the test. These are S and W Premium Bartlett Pear Halves. Been in storage. Uh, well, it's hard to say. Maybe upwards to to nine years. The expiration on these was thirteen. So, yeah, I'd say they're definitely they're more than seven years old. Uh, maybe upwards to nine or ten years old. They're delicious. Uh, they, they don't appear to have degraded at all. 
Um, they have been in a, a cool, dry, uh, consistent, consistent temperature environment, dark. So yeah, kind of optimal conditions for storing canned goods. But these these held up just fine. I definitely would would eat these. Um, and just a little nutritional information, I did look at the back of it. They're high in sugar, right? So um, I suspect there's a lot of sugar. In fact, it was 17 grams per serving. There's about three and a half servings per can. And if memory serves, there's about 80 calories per serving. So you're looking at about 300 calories per can. And I know when you're planning, doing your you know, calorie calculations for preparations and your how many months and weeks and all that can my family subsist on the food that we have, uh, I think a can is worth about 300 calories, right? But of course, you'll check on that yourself as you're planning, but these held up just fine. Uh, thanks for watching. I look forward to doing the next uh, prepper taste test or food challenge. Uh, so uh, stay tuned. Thanks for watching. Take care. Uh, we'll see you next time.